A Delaware County man has a lot to be grateful for this holiday season. If it wasn't for some quick thinking lifeguards, he may not even be there. Our Chris O'Connell has his story. They were running through the building and opened the door up right as my face was going underwater. The timing couldn't have been more perfect for Jim McBride of Leicester, Delaware County. One year ago, almost to the hour, he nearly died in this YMCA hot tub. If it wasn't for this automatic external defibrillator and these two lifeguards, Jim wouldn't be telling this story. I pulled him out and then started CPR on him because he wasn't breathing and I called for help. I was shocked twice and I was revived at that point. Shocked back to life, he was rushed to the emergency room. McBride spent the next week in the hospital after a double bypass. But he was alive to see his new wife of just six months. And it doesn't end there. After recovering from heart surgery for the last year, McBride is back at the pool. But this time, he's the one saving lives. Right then, I knew I wanted to try to help people. Recently retired from the TSA, the 68-year-old got certified to be a lifeguard. And this week, he started his first part-time shift working in the same YMCA with the same lifeguards who saved his life. As CEO, you always worry that have you done enough training? Is the staff trained well enough? Are they paying attention? And when something like this happens, it just reaffirms everything you've done. Very cool-headed and uh, just followed their training. The Springfield YMCA now has seven AEDs, and they've even knocked down walls to make sure those hot tubs are more visible to lifeguards. For Jim, that won't be a problem. Do you ever go back to the hot tub? No, no, no. The doctor says no, and I learned my lesson, so... He does say he's living, breathing proof of CPR training and AEDs in all public places. I just want to tell that story and help people and train people and... Make sure that somebody's there for somebody else like somebody was there for me. In Springfield, Delaware County, Chris O'Connell, Fox 29 News. What a great way to pay it forward. And He's doing what he loves, made, clearly. And maybe save a life himself. Yeah. And, yeah. Big time pay it forward. All right, good story from Chris O'Connell there. Mm -hmm.